everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gerard. Today I've got the brand new Helix scope here with me, freshly released from the guys from Element Optics. This is the 4 to 16 by 44, and I've got it fitted on my beautiful GRS. I can't wait to show you what this scope is all about. The new 4 to 16 Helix has a more compact and smaller design versus his big brother, the 6 to 24, thus making this scope a perfect fit for my GRS, and it really, really looks nice. That's the first one down for this morning, 48 yards. Perfect, eight shots, 36 yards. What a perfect shot, 85 yards. Joining me today here on the farm is my good friend Kevin and he took this beautiful shot in this pigeon. Now as we watch this in a thousand frames per second, you can see that that pellet hit this pigeon perfectly in the spine neck area. Once the pellet hits here, a bird has no chance not even flapping or flying away, it's just going to go straight down. Let's talk about the magnification first on the scope. It is a 4 to 16 times and a lot of you out there might think that 16 times is not going to be enough. Well, I can promise you one thing. At 16 times magnification, this scope will fit any air gun around to do most of the air gun shooting that you want to do especially hunting. If you want to fit it onto a center fire, this will be the perfect combination for a vomiting setup like a 22 250, 260 or even a 243. Beautiful, 87 yards down. Awesome stuff, 45 yards. <laughs> 90 yards down. Now, if there was an Olympics for birds, I would have given this pigeon a gold medal for that beautiful backstroke. Here's another perfect upper neck chest shot. And if we look at the slow-mo footage, we can see that pellet crashing into the chest area and immediately you can see the tail feathers being fanned which is a good indication that this is a perfect shot to the spine or neck area. The objective of the scope in the front is a 44 millimeters in diameter. I can tell you this for sure that I've taken this out for early mornings and late afternoon hunting and it gives me perfect picture even in low light conditions. For hunting, this is all that you're going to need, plus the combination of good glass inside is perfect for this setup. Oh, beautiful, 87 yards. Perfect shot, 92 yards, straight down. Oh, perfect. 84 yards down. This next shot is another perfect indication of the spine upper neck. And as the pellet crashes into this pigeon, again, you can see that beautiful fan on the tail area, meaning that there is no chance that this bird is going anywhere. The reticle I can't show you from the outside, I'm going to have to show you some footage. What I like the most about this reticle design, if you go down to lower magnification, it's still nice and thick that it will pull your eye quickly to the target. And when you push the magnification all the way up, it doesn't overpower the image that you get through the lens. Oh, what a beautiful shot, 88 yards.
beautiful shot 92 yards our sparrow now the next clip that you're about to see is something that i have to show you otherwise you will never believe me this is an 18 grain pellet versus a house sparrow this must be one of the best shots that i've caught on camera the pellet hitting this house sparrow center of mass couldn't have hit it any better Well, I'm not going to speak about the scope the whole day. I need to speak about my gun setup here as well. This is the Dreamline GRS. Beautiful, beautiful GRS stock. I've got a standard Dreamline Classic uh, action in the top of it. Obviously, like you know, I've got the new Element Helix first focal plane scope on the top. I've got a Atlas bipod at the bottom. And then I am shooting 18.13 JSB pellets today at 902 feet per second. <laughs> 89 yards down. Oh, smack down. 38 yards. <laughs> 42 yards. Watching this replay, this looks like a scene from a Charlie Chaplin movie. Look at that dive down to the floor. <laughs> and moving from the house sparrows back to the pigeons here's a cracker of a shot on 85 yards just look at that 18.13 jsb crashing into the neck area sending that pigeon straight down the tune for the gun is a simple simple tune it's basically standard as what i got it from the factory the rec pressure set just over 100 to 10 bar. I've left my hammer spring tensioner at the back exactly as what I got it from FX. And at the current setting, I'm getting about two full mags. That's about 36 shots with one full. Another one down, 44 yards. Oh, 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 oh. Another one down, 86 yards. Here's one of the last two shots of the day. This is an 18 grain pellet at 102 yards, smashing into the neck area yet again and sending this pigeon down. There's just something nice watching a pest bird going down in slow-mo. And finally, we end off the day with a nice close one at 27 yards. Well, unfortunately, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed today's content. Now you know what the new Element Helix Scope is about. And I wanna just say, if you like today's content, please remember to smash that like button for me. And for all the new guys watching now, remember to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>